Can hackers hack your Wi-Fi? The answer will surprise you. Ah, nothing beats good Wi-Fi. Whether you're at the airport, in a restaurant, or on your comfy couch, having good Wi-Fi is a blessing. But what if I told you that using Wi-Fi can put you in danger? And I don't mean someone hacked my Facebook account type of danger, I mean someone emptied my bank account type of danger. Because once a hacker gets into your Wi-Fi, they can easily access your personal information, such as social media passwords, credit card details, and even online banking apps. So keep watching because in this video, I'll explain to you if your home Wi-Fi can be hacked, how to tell if your Wi-Fi has been hacked, and what to do if your Wi-Fi is hacked. And probably the most important one, how to prevent your Wi-Fi from being hacked. Let's start with the first one, your home Wi-Fi. You're probably thinking, meh, I'm at home, I'm safe. Or who would come after one individual? Hackers will be after big companies, right? Well, that shouldn't be your thinking. Millions of households are still using outdated routers, which are easy to pray for hackers. Once they get into your router settings, cyber criminals can do whatever they want, even lock you out of your own network. And here are four main ways they do that. Number one, trying hundreds of different passwords. That is why your password should be a complicated one. Number two, using manufacturer's default password. Remember, always change your default password and network name immediately. Number three, DNS hijacking. With this method, they break into your router and change the DNS settings so that it redirects your traffic to harmful websites. DNS hijacking is the one that is out of your control. Unfortunately, many people are not familiar enough with this problem, nor are they aware of the available solution. Programs like Aura offer a very easy solution. They simply detect these websites and block them if you try to visit them. I'll leave a link in the description of this video so you can try the 14 day free trial period. I'd also encourage you to do that because you have no idea what imagination cyber criminals have. For example, a two-year-old boy in the UK couldn't sleep for weeks. The parents visited many doctors to find the reason until they found the shocking truth. A creepy man hacked into their baby monitor and was shushing the baby in the middle of the night. Just when you think you've seen it all. Do you recognize any of these brands? AVM, Asus, Netgear, D-Link, Linksys, TP-Link. These and a hundred more manufacturers were tested for security flaws. The result? Almost all of them had a backdoor open for cyber criminals. Some even had a whole gateway. But can your phone be hacked? Well, if you're using Wi-Fi, then yes, especially if it's a public one. No matter if it's a phone, tablet, or computer, Android, or Apple, you can be at risk. Hackers can access enough information to commit fraud and even steal your identity. So how can you know your Wi-Fi has been hacked? Well, watch out for these signs. The more people who use your network, the slower it is. So if your internet is slower than usual, you might not be alone. If you see software or applications on your devices that you don't remember installing. And while the last one can be a result of a night out, this one is the biggest red flag. Your Wi-Fi password has changed. That brings us to the next step, which is what to do if you find out your Wi-Fi has been hacked. Very quickly, perform a factory reset on your router. Change your Wi-Fi password and network name immediately. Disable remote administration on your router. Scan your device for malware left by hackers. Aura can help you check and locate viruses on your devices. What Aura can also help with is identity theft monitoring. If you really have been exposed, your whole identity could be at risk. And lastly, how to prevent having your Wi-Fi hacked. Change the default router name and password. Update the firmware of your router. Deactivate remote administration. Use a VPN to encrypt your traffic. Disable your router's WPS setting. If your router has a Wi-Fi protected access, enable it. Use your ethernet cable instead. Use antivirus software like the one Aura provides with all of its programs. Do these eight steps and browse the internet with confidence. And remember, just because your router is in your living room, that doesn't necessarily make you safer. Monitor your network and configure your router settings. And subscribe to this channel for more tips on online security. My name is Upton. Have a good day.